La Lacan. This had to be one of my favorite places because I didn't actually know about this restaurant. I lived in Miami Beach for a few years, and ever since we filmed there, I've gone back there multiple times. It's okay. Stick with me. I'll show you a few other places. You never answer my phone calls if we're not filming. Well, you call me. Your friend. You're literally a block and a half away from Ocean Drive. It's so they can fantastic. walk to meet us. They don't need to spend money on a cab or have to worry about taking maybe a car they rented out and finding right. parking. So they go to the beach for the day, they go back to the hotel, they shower, and they're like, okay, we're going to meet you for dinner. I'm like, how about this cute little Italian restaurant? Right. La La Conda. Getting outside was nice because it, uh, it was a little bit off the water, so you didn't have all that wind because Miami Beach can get extremely windy to where everything's flying away, things are falling over. Thank you for that. Thank you very helpful. I'm not going to say anything about rain. <laughs> that's what I think that's cute about this little Italian restaurant is he's really about, he's bringing Italy here to Miami right. Beach. It's cute, it's quaint, it's, it's just the right size, it's just the right service, and the food's going to be really good. <laughs> My favorite thing about this place is their, um, their pastas, most of them on the menu, are homemade. And you can just really taste the difference of homemade pasta. Your, what was it, the fiocchi with the pear and the blue cheese? So good. I've gone back for that multiple right? times. The truffle I, pasta, yeah. amazing. Mm -hmm. The pasta's amazing. You know what I love about this dish? It's so good. It's so chewy and fresh. And I don't say that often about pasta, but it's fresh. You can taste the chef's love. Yeah. Which I always agree. I think this, if this you don't put delicious. love into your food, then it's not gonna it's not gonna come out well. Right. I think you were supposed to leave me a bite. No. I, no, know, you were mistaken. Right. You didn't leave me no. a bite. That's nope. what it was. Right. Selfish. You know what's great about also being south of Fifth is you have the west side of Miami Beach, like Monty's. And then you have all those condo buildings, you have like the Icon and so forth in Milano. But you know, when people come to visit, sometimes they rent out a condo. And they don't know where to go when they're renting out a condo, right? Right. They go like, you know, they'll rent a car, they'll have some bicycles sometimes, or they'll get a scooter, and then they don't know where to go. So what's great is they could actually walk, what is it, five, six blocks, and come here for dinner and then walk back home. It's right. a nice, cool breeze, cool walk, and everything else. Most happening. of the restaurants down here are very original, too. You don't have very touristy restaurants down here. Which I love. That's what I re You know what? You touched upon a great point because Miami Beach does not have all those chain restaurants. No. There are a couple, well, I know. Well, there's a TGI Friday's yeah, right over there, but exactly. that's about it. That's, they, I, they've done not a great job close. with kind of eliminating them. Well, it kind of falls into date one, two, or three. It actually opens itself up. You could stop in for an appetizer and a drink at the bar mm -hmm. for a first date and keep walking. You could go in for an intimate date, second, third date, you know, and you want to move the date along, you can sit outside. Or you could go for the casual third, fourth date kind of thing where you've been out a few times and you've had drinks before and now you kind of, well, let's sit around, and maybe we'll have some of our friends join us too and that kind of thing and do that on the inside. It's very diverse, so Lalacan is, you know, very accessible. And the food's delicious. I love the bar. I love this little, you know, stool area, sit up. And uh, I love the fact that I can sit, have an espresso, and finish my night. I think I need this right now. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.